So God bless you all. This one is about marriage. I want to release this word very quickly. I pray blesses whoever this world is for. Praise the Lord. Right? This is why God wants you to trust his plan for your marriage to life. This is exactly the reason why. The Lord wants you to trust his plan for your marriage to life. Let me just let you know right now very quickly. You see, God himself is the one that started this um, institution of marriage, right? And Adam came first, and then Eve, and then he joined them together, right? And then they became one. Praise the Lord. So God, God being um, the, can I use the word orchestrator? Or, or the mastermind behind this beautiful thing called marriage God is sovereign right and we know that God is in charge of everything he is the power that is above and greater than any other power so why does God want you to trust him for your marital life for your marriage or marriage restoration if you've been separated or divorced simply because he is God and because he loves you yes you see god really wants you to connect with him when you connect with the lord when you obey the lord knowing that he is sovereign and that he is god and all-powerful and that he you know brought the entire idea of marriage in the first place from the very beginning the lord begins to favor you praise the lord now, God wants you to trust him that he has the right person for you. God wants you to trust him that he has the right husband for you, has the right wife for you, right? Because he's in control. It's, it's so simple. God just wants you to just to surrender to him. The same way you said, Lord Jesus, I confess that you're my savior and literally just give your life to Christ, right? God wants you to, to also give your marital life to him. What, whatever it is that has to do with your marriage, that may be broken down or you're single and you want to go into marriage, this is why God wants you to trust him because he's sovereign. And he began this thing called marriage. He's in charge. Praise the Lord. So trust God that he will bring you to that beautiful time because it was said he makes all things beautiful in, in his time. He will bring you to that beautiful time, that right time, Having seen your trust in him, your obedience, you passed every test, praise the Lord, to bring it to that time where it's the right you know, window for you to meet your spouse, your kingdom spouse, your supernatural spouse, your godly spouse. God brings you into that time. So between then and, you know, sorry, between now and when God you know, brings you to the, to the one that he wants you to be with, he needs you to trust him, having the understanding that, hey, my child, I'm in control. I did bring this thing called marriage together. I need you to trust in me, trust in my person, trust in my name. I'm faithful. I'm not going to fail you, right? If it's God's will for you to be married, you will definitely be, be married. God will join you to the one that is for you to go into destiny with to do to do ministry with or whatever assignment right the one that's going to be, be able to help you fulfill your purpose and then you've been able to help your, your spouse also fulfill their purpose as well so trust his nature really is what the lord is saying right just 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 trust his person trust his nature trust trust in his name because god is reliable and because he's dependable this is the reason why he wants you to trust his plan for your marital life don't feel like oh i've been waiting for so long i'm single or my marriage or i've been separated i've been divorced i've been this i've been that i've been that hey, 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 hey. slow down be one with the lord connect with the lord spend time with the lord just get to know the lord so that when you eventually go into the marriage you know how to handle marriage as a man as a woman you know how to handle the marriage because you've worked with the lord and you're now one with the lord you 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 got married to the lord right be a wife before you become a wife be a husband before you become a husband okay this is so important for us to know in this time that's why we see many marriages breaking down because people don't just trust god and don't and don't walk with the lord and don't join yet to the lord and then they get into marriage because you see marriage is a long life thing right that's why it just it just breaks down when you get into it without this understanding so trust god's plan for your marriage for your marital life and he will bring it to to come to pass and perfect your union if you take time to work with him love him serve him obey him during your singleness just trust god praise god god bless you